rolls up, folds up, however you want to do it. If you want to put it together and kind of fold it up, put your little rubber band around it. I mean, What's up everybody, Tactical Santa here, and today we're gonna to be talking about the comfort concealment belt. Uh, the reason I wanted to talk about this is I've had a lot of people either ask me what's some good options if I've got on like gym shorts, uh, running pants, sweatpants. You know, ladies also have been asking me for some good options. And then I've also had people tell me, oh, I don't carry when I'm wearing this, or I don't carry when I'm wearing that, mainly talking about like gym shorts, going to the gym, jogging pants, jogging. This right here is a great, great option. Uh, I know it's been a minute since I have talked about this. I did the little unboxing review and talking about it. But now that I've had a chance to where it's some, um, I wanted to go ahead and do a little follow-up review here to discuss, you know, why this is a good option for you. Now, before I get started though, I do want to say this is not a permanent option, okay? This is only based off of gym shorts, jogging pants, something, gym style clothing. Let's just uh, refer to it that way or workout style exercise style clothing say I've got some gym shorts on and I need to run down to the grocery store or whatever I don't feel like putting all my pants belt holster this is a really really great option right here all right again this is not a permanent option this doesn't need to be your main concealed carry belt you need to find something a little bit better. Ladies as well, this does not need to be your main go-to carry belt. There are a lot of great options out there for ladies that are a lot better than what this is. Again, this is something, if you gotta go quick, you got yoga pants, exercise, let's just say, for, so we can talk about both men and women. We'll just say workout clothing. You got on some type of workout clothing. This is a great, great option. Again, not, not, not a permanent option. Uh, for my ladies out there, I'll have some links up in the video here for you to go and take a look at. They're really, really great options. To me, those would be more permanent options. Uh, this is again, just something quick to throw on. It's It's been absolutely great for me. So I have been using this some when I'm wearing uh, gym shorts, workout clothing, like I said, I'll have some pictures up here uh, for you to kind of see, you know, what it looks like uh, as far as wearing it. Now, I wear this inside the waistband. Um, I use both inside the waistband holsters and I've used outside the waistband holsters, but when this is on, no matter what the holster really says it is, it's pretty much inside the waistband. And like I said, you'll see in the pictures that I've got up so you can take a look and see what I'm talking about here. But this neoprene, it's got a little bit of, you see this has a little bit of flex to it. So you've got your Velcro here. All right, your Velcro runs from here to here. So this is a extra large, I believe it was 43 to 50, something like that. Now, I will be honest, when I first got this thing, it was barely hanging on. Like, I mean, it was barely hanging on here, but I will give it credit. It hung in there, all right, standing up, sitting down. It hung in there even though it was barely hanging on. Now that I have lost some weight, I am a lot more closer to where it's almost at the end. So, you know, this has also kind of been a good thing letting me see how my weight loss is coming. But it's been a great belt. You know, the neoprene, is, it feels comfortable against your skin. All right, it flexes when you move and stuff. I have not had any issues with it not holding the gun 
in the holster up. I've, it doesn't sag, it doesn't drop or anything like that. You know, I did read some reviews where people said it didn't hold that well. I don't know what kind of gun they were carrying. I'm just carrying a Springfield Hellcat. So, I mean, you go and slap on a freaking full-size Glock 17 all Gucci'd out with red dots and flashlights and trying to carry an extra mag, might not work for you. I don't know. I've seen some pictures on the website where the people are carrying stuff like that. So that's just what I'm using is, is my Springfield Hellcat when I carry this or when I use this to carry. And it's it works great. I mean, it, the, 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 no problem coming out of the holster. It doesn't like ride up. All right, the Velcro doesn't break loose when I'm drawing it out or anything like that. But if you're looking for a good option to where you don't have to change, you're just in some workout clothing or hell, if you're in your damn pajamas and you still need to be able to carry, here you go right here. Like I said, it's it'll it works with inside the waistband or outside the waistband holsters, inch and a half is what it is. So you're not gonna be disappointed. I've been very, very happy with it. But like I said earlier, yes, I'm gonna beat that dead horse. This is not a permanent option. This needs to be an addition to your permanent option. All right, ladies, this is a great, great thing. Um, I've even seen some women have pictures where they've worn some halter top style shirts and use this to be able to carry, uh, especially if you go in and uh, follow Lena Mikulek on Instagram. You know, she's got some uh, showing where she has used this. Uh, so go in there and definitely check that out. I don't, I don't think that you're gonna be disappointed in this at all. Uh, I will tell you the reason I say it's not a permanent option is it's not, this is not, this should not be your main go-to belt when you're gonna carry. If you show up to one of my training classes wearing this, no, not gonna happen. To me, this is better than those real big, thick, or I shouldn't say thick, the tall, neoprene belly bands and stuff because this allows you to use your holster where with a lot of those belly bands you've got to use the holster that's already built into it oh excuse me it's got a little snap that comes over the top not a huge fan of that because that's not something i want to be trying to fool with when i'm trying to fight for my life this lets you use your holster the price point on these is not that expensive. They float between, I think, 35, 40 bucks. And again, they've got different sizes depending on your waist length. Bigger guys, you know, unfortunately, this probably isn't gonna work because it stops at 50. Because like I said, I was, at my biggest, I was barely holding on here. Uh, but it did, it did work. It did work. It didn't pop loose or anything like that. But now that I've lost some weight, it's giving me a little bit more room to play with. But go in and check it out, comfortconcealment.com. I'll have it up here in the screen so you can go in and take a look. And I'll also have it down in the description as well, too. The, and you notice, I know some of y'all might be saying, well, I don't like the white lettering. Well, now they've got their blackout version where the lettering is white or the lettering is black. And you don't really see that because some people are like, oh, am I giving away? Blah, blah. But they don't have that now. They've got their blackout version. I'll be honest, I'm probably going to go ahead and pick me up one of those because I wasn't a big fan of the white lettering, but got the job done. The waist of my pants did a good job of covering all that up anyway, so wasn't a big deal. But go in, check it out. If you got questions, please feel free to put them down in the comments below. Uh, the, the other thing too is that's so great about this is when you travel, you can take it with you. There you go, look, I mean, it just rolls right up. Rolls up, folds up, however you wanna do it. If you wanna put it together and kind of fold it up put your little rubber band around it. I mean, it's great to travel. So here's your great option if you've got to throw something on and 
kind of go quick. It's been great for me. But go check it out. Like I said, comments, questions, concerns, emotional outbursts. You know, I'll be glad to respond to them as quickly as I can. Uh, again, I cannot thank you all enough for the support. Please continue to like, share, subscribe, get the word out there. Also, check out our Give, Send, Go. Uh, we're trying to up our range, add another range, and make some improvements. And I'm, I'm looking for everyone's help. Uh, I really do not want to get investors involved. I want my true followers supporters subscribers to be the one to be the ones to invest in this but that's what we're trying to do with that uh, anything you can give is greatly greatly appreciated uh, if but at most just please continue to share comment like subscribe make sure you hit that bell icon so you can get notified when i post new stuff and we're going to have some live events coming up as well too so be on the lookout for that also uh, especially now that we've got our uh, internet service issues uh, getting corrected so i apologize i wasn't able to go live uh, like I wanted to the other day, but we've got all that stuff coming up. Thank you all very much. It's, it's greatly, greatly appreciated. Uh, I, it truly means a lot uh, to let me know I am making a difference out there and everybody is continuing to support. I, I just, I'm, I can't say how much I appreciate it, but also check out our link tree. It's got everything in there. Uh, I'll have that up in the screen as well too. So you can go in and look at all our social media and everything that we have to offer. And always remember, folks, if you're not shooting, you're reloading. If you're not reloading, you're fighting. If you're not fighting, you're dead. Train to live. See you on the range.